Shelly, I eat for breakfast. But then I remember the gracious God-given gift of macaroni and cheese. And you know what I ate for breakfast? Cinnamon bagels. Now, joining me in approximately 15 seconds will be Owen Lapp. Owen Lapp, his initials are O something L. Now come, Owen. Join in the gracious spirits of this recording. Hello. How has your day been? It's been very good. I also enjoy cinnamon bagels. They're very good. I don't like cinnamon bagels. Then why did you have one? It was the first thing I saw. Okay. What did you do today, Owen? Well, I woke up and I okay, nobody cares. was very sad to hear on the radio that Ohio State had what won. What was your favorite part of this interview? Um, That's amazing. Not much has happened so far. That's amazing. Wow. I enjoyed shaking your hand. Now, what are your goals for your career? Which career? My school career or like an actual job career? No. Your eating career. Eating career? Um, yes. I would like to try to eat as healthy as possible while still eating things that taste good. A good a good mix. Now here's a question. Here's a question in which I don't think you will be able to remotely answer. It has to do with the village of San Juan. Now okay. San Juan yeah. is a village in Mexico. Mm-hmm. Mexico I didn't know that, yeah. San Juan is a little province in Mexico. Mm -hmm. What would you rather do in San Juan? Would you rather fight gorilla snakes or kill giant garoppolo birds? This is a very hard decision. I want you to think about this very carefully. Are giant garoppolo birds dangerous like are they giant but peaceful or are they giant and they want to kill me they have two beaks one beak for eating one beak for drinking Mm. now these birds they're very very dangerous and Mm. they're only found in san juan well that's why the population of san juan is currently at zero oh i did not know that um well, the, the gorilla snakes, you said I would have to fight those, but you said I would have to kill the Garoppolo birds, so I would probably fight the gorilla snakes, because all I have to do to fulfill what you're saying is fight them, and then I'm done. The bird, I would actually have to kill it. Okay. Which seems harder. I'll be back in a second. But what do you want? This wasn't on the waiver that I signed. I didn't. Now go. Fight the gorillas. Be back soon. After a short break, we'll be back on this episode of Hard Hitting Interviews with Parker. State Farm is an amazing, amazing company. They sell you states and farms at the same price, in the same bundle box. Okay. We were back from that short interview break. Owen has joined. Are you okay? How yeah, you I'm, I'm good. They took, they, they took my glasses, but um, I, I got them. So. That's very impressive. Now the, there's the same amount of living gorilla snakes in San Juan as there are citizens. Very impressive. Now, see, what I like to do on my interview, I like to make my interviewees comfortable. So, Owen, I will allow you take, to take over this next 30 seconds of the episode. I'll be back in five seconds. So, um, don't fight gorilla snakes <clears throat> and listen to all sports all the time. It's a pretty great podcast. Now, I'm going to wrap up this episode by asking you one more question, which you must give me an answer for. Would you rather have 12 pixie sticks 
for 13 candy corns. While I'm personally not a big fan of pixie sticks, so I would go with candy corn, even if there were less candy corn than there were pixie sticks. The number doesn't really matter. I don't like pixie sticks. So. See, that is a very interesting point. And that wraps up this episode of Hard Hitting Interviews with Parker Wolf. Cinnamon bagels. <laughs> 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 and you know what I ate for breakfast? Macaroni and cheese. Oh, wait. <laughs>